congratulations on the movie. Never thought I would actually cry over a Disney film, but it happened. I was like bawling towards the end. All Disney movies make me cry. And really? Every time, yeah, and every time I'm like, I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. Like for Frozen, I was like, oh, I should watch this. I was like, I'm not gonna cry. And then I ended up crying. Wait, what part <laughs> of Frozen did you? I didn't cry in Frozen. I thought she was annoying. I was like, go away, bro. <laughs> Why are you always at my door every day? You know for what, Damon? We need to chat when the cameras are off. <laughs> <laughs> This is Tadashi, my older brother. 33rd test. Wait, 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 stop. This is the 84th test. Hello, I am Baymax. It works! Oh, this is amazing! He wanted to help a lot of people. People keep saying Tadashi's not really gone. As long as we remember him. Hello, I am Baymax. Tadashi programmed me to heal the sick and injured. When Tadashi died, Hiro kind of looked to Baymax as a source of comfort, mm -hmm. inspiration for that type of brotherly love. When you guys were growing up, were you guys kind of attached to any objects? I was like not attached to this E.T. E doll uh -huh. that my parents bought me. And it was one of those things where like I would throw it away in the trash can and then it would come back <gasps> into my room. Like it just would not go away. So it's the opposite of being Really? So it was attached to you. It was so scary. And it scary. was possessed. <laughs> I mean, as a young child, it was kind of a frightening looking house. thing. Was, that yeah. is pretty scary. Really? Uh, I used to have a little dinosaur that uh, was like a, what are those called with the long necks? A giraffe? Uh, oh no, 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 sorry. Like a, a sorry. It's like a giraffe <laughs> dinosaur. Brontosaurus. Uh, uh, Brontosaurus, okay. yes. And it had one of those neck. it was like a broken neck, so anytime I wanted to talk to it, I'd have to like pull oh. its neck up. Aww. Hey little dude. <laughs> yeah, that's cute. <laughs> We gotta catch him. We can't go against that guy. We're nerds. Trust me, I know about robotics. We can be way more. Anybody else's suit riding up on him? Well, let's talk about Wasabi's character for a second. He's so interesting because in the beginning, he's like following all the rules and regulations. And then towards the end, he kind of embraces the chaos Absolutely. that comes with being a superhero. Yes. Was there ever a time in your career as actors and actresses that you guys are kind of like, okay, I'm just gonna let go. Whatever happens, happens. Wow, that was a pretty uh, intense question. Mm -hmm. um, definitely, I feel like it, uh, this last movie they shot, Let's Be Cops, there were a couple of uh, ruffled feathers that happened you know, within it, and then eventually we, Jake and I, uh, the actor in the movie, we just came together and we were like, look, we gotta, uh, we gotta make do, and we did. Come on, kick it down, then punch it. Why is Baymax wearing carbon fiber underpants? This may undermine my non-threatening, huggable design. He's glorious. And Jamie, you've played so many badass females in the past, and this one too. If you can pick one character that you've ever played in your career and kind of enlist her to become part of the uh, superhero team, which one would you choose? Well, I feel like there's some resemblance with Gogo and Amber from Sucker Punch, so I guess I would say Mulan. I think it'd be cool to do like a Disney mashup. Oh, okay. So it'd be cool to, to see Mulan as Big Hero 7. Fa Mulan. <laughs> I love that guy. Fa Mulan. <laughs> I love it, you guys. Got a little mustache. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, why is your mustache like that, dude? What's wrong with you? Low battery. Harry, baby. That was amazing. You gave me a heart attack. Clear. Stop, stop, stop. It's just an expression. What do you say, buddy? We. Okay, let's get you back in your luggage.